Hello sweet soul, welcome back to Conscious Lifestyle Coaching. Today's message is to let you know that you are a lotus flower blooming out of the mud. And yes, that mud was just a part of your process and your journey as it is now to be into the light and to shine and blossom in this beautiful version of yourself. That mud, that dirt, it was meant for you to turn your pain into power so that when you are ready to lead, which if you're listening to this message, you are ready. If this confirms in your spirit that you are, because only you can decide. But this is a confirmation that you are ready to get on that stage and to speak your truth and to share your story and to share your gifts. And to honor the journey of that darkness, that dirt that you had to survive in for so long. And now you're accepting your journey. You're recognizing now that you've spent the last few years of your life in a slow process of discovering who you are, your true gifts here on this earth, remembering your divine nature, remembering that you are a spiritual being having a human experience and you came here with a soul purpose. You have unique skills and talents, unique to your soul, meant to share with the world, to raise the vibration of the planet towards greater peace and love. And you've spent three years now how many years it has been for you in your transformation journey of discovering what those gifts are. So now you know. I'm confirming that you know. You know who you are. You know what you're here to do. You know what you have to offer. So now that you're blessed with this awareness, it is time to share. It is time to share your story. It is time to speak your truth. You are ready. And as you share your story, you're going to shine light on so many others who are going through the similar tunnel of transformation that you had to walk through. We are all guides to each other, so this journey of, of ascension and elevation does not mean that you're better than anyone or risen higher than anyone. We're all just here to walk with each other and remind each other of certain things and to be teachers and guides. And we have a specific, unique story that is a prayer to someone else looking for an answer we all minister to each other if you take on that role which is which if you're watching this you're accepting your role as a leader and guide for others walking and experiencing a pain that you've had to endure and to overcome so as you're leaving one season and entering your next know that your role your position is also shifting and changing and you're ready please speak your truths and share your gifts and you know what they are now now it's just accepting now it's just asking spirit what do you want me to do with this show me who can i help i'm ready to receive them so if you're if you've started a business, if you started an endeavor and you have these gifts and you're ready to share and now you've hit a wall and no one's there, and they are, they have all were, they were already assigned to you a long time ago and you were assigned to them. The people who you are meant to serve at this stage in your life are right there. You see them, you know them, or else you wouldn't have walked this far so now, just letting spirit, letting yourself know you're ready to receive and you're ready to serve. You're ready to teach. You're ready to fulfill your role and purpose. And it's not going to be an overnight success. It's going to be a long next stage of your life journey ahead of you. And it's going to be so beautiful. But now you know the new foundation, the new vibration you know that frequency within yourself that is your wholeness, your peace, your strength that you have been working on and developing and discovering for so many years now. You know who you are. You know your authentic self. Now, it, now the journey is to continue to honor that self. Continue to honor that vision. Continue to share your gifts. And do not let anyone dim your light. Do not let anyone deny your truth 
continue to think for yourself. It never cease your prayers. It never stop speaking your truth and sharing your story because I promise you it is going to liberate others who cannot see the light yet, but you are the light for them. At that time, in the stage, on the journey, when you connect. So I hope that you are able to understand why Spirit had to take you on this wild journey through this mud to get to where you are right now. And I know it might seem scary because you don't know what's next and yet you're here. God is about to use you in so many ways. You're about to elevate and rise into places you can never imagine. And you will be on that stage. You will be serving your gift. So I'm proud of you for being on this journey. I see you. Thank you for seeing me. Thank you for sharing your gifts with the world. And don't give up. Because we're just getting started. So, again, my name is Rayleigh Dushin. I'm an author, poet, speaker, and healer. Please like, comment, subscribe. Please stay connected on this journey together so we continue to rise as a collective towards our chosen and highest life path and purpose. Namaste.